Yo, 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 what up, YouTube Reacts? It's your boy Daddy Easy here, iPod Drop Ray Hacker, otherwise known as Only Use Me Tomahawk. Since some of y'all may know me as Easy, like I always say, to the black, to the blue, my avatar on my YouTube channel. Yeah, buddy, and welcome to the Sunday chat commentary where you know I like kicking that shit, doggy style. Now, uh, nah, <laughs> so welcome to my Sunday chat commentary. Uh, like I said, I'm going to try to keep up with the Sunday chat commentaries as I have not been doing it for a while. Um, y'all know I've been building my PC, my gaming setup, my ultimate gaming shit. So, let's get to it, guys. You already know how we're going to get it down. We're going to be kicking that shit all night long. Nah, we ain't going to be doing this shit all night long, guys. But, we got 18 minutes of fun and Avenger. <coughs> I can't do that shit. I still got a cold. And I'm, every time I try to do that shit, I wind up coughing. But sit back, relax, and we got a nice little commentary for you guys. Yes, we do. And um, some of the X-Fags out there, y'all gonna get real butthurt over this. Y'all ain't gonna be happy. Y'all wanna get mad. Y'all gonna get up here and be like, this motherfucker, we gonna kick on me. We gonna, we gonna find this nigga. We gonna kill this nigga. Look at this. One, two. Uh, we gonna kill this nigga. <laughs> so... <coughs> like I said, I'm still sick. But you Xbox fanboys, y'all really. I mean, I mean, I mean, I mean, you guys is really funny. <laughs> so uh, lately, I had a commentary that I was going to do about these Xbox fanboys and shit like this. I mean, really getting gritty. But I can't do it for the Sunny Chat commentary because this shit is going on SoundCloud. And remember, you can check out. Uh, this video and shit like this on SoundCloud, the audio is going to be on SoundCloud, so make sure you go and check that out. Okay, let's get to the topic. So, it was said, and I heard that, which, which was the words I really want to use, what's the words I really, really want to use, that a GTX 1080 and a GTX 1070 does not sell better than the Xbox One S. What? What? The Xbox One S sells better than the fucking GTX 1080 and a GTX 1070? What? Have you seen what I have? What? Yo, I own both of them. I own a GTX 1080 Founders Edition. And I own a GTX 1070 EVGA for the win RGB version that has that oh so lovely RGB colors on it that I'm loving. And you mean to sit here and tell me that it's not selling? What? You know how many PC gamers sat up there and waited for that fucking graphics card to come out? Let me put it to you like this. That, that GPU sold out faster than the freaking console did. Soon as it was available for sale, soon as it was out, people brought that shit like crazy. I had a hard time of fucking getting a GTX 1080 Founders Edition, and that was the only cards available. EVGA came out with a Founders Edition. Uh, Nvidia came out with a uh, Founders Edition. What else? I think it's Ping. Uh, I, I don't know the fucking name of the company. Um, all the companies. What is it? Asus. I believe they came out with a 1080. Fucking all the companies that you can think of that's dealing with uh, computers and shit like that came out with the 1080s Founders Edition. And those shit's been selling out like hot cakes. Believe me. I mean, you cannot get a fucking uh, GPU if your life depended on it. I mean, the uh, reviewers, they had the uh, GPUs and shit like that. You know, but people like us, we was not getting no fucking uh, GPU. If your life depended on it. So basically, once I was able to get my hands on a GTX uh, 1080, which only took me about what? Uh, I say about two to three weeks if I was actually able to get it. I got that shit. And you think that it's some, that, that was not selling out faster than the Xbox One S? Are you fucking kidding me? Yo, y'all Xbox fanboys, man, for real. Y'all going brain dead. I don't know what the hell is going on. I, 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 I think I know what's happening. I mean, shit is stomping your brains. The PC is dominating you. Fucking PlayStation is dominating you. 
Y'all not getting no games and shit like that. Uh, uh, it's just so much shit that's happening that I believe that y'all brains is fucking melting. It's like, y'all can't handle the stress. Y'all getting PTSD and shit like that. And, you know, I, I, I listened to a podcast uh, that happened, uh, what it was, yesterday. And I kind of got a little bit, I lost a little bit of brain cells and shit hearing what these x facts was talking about. I mean... What? What? Then I had to go to the other podcast to, you know, rebuild back up my brain cells and shit like that to get some common sense. I was like, the shit with these Xbox fanboys say and talk about is stupid. And another topic I want to get to right now on top of this Sunday chat commentary. That's right. It's the Sunday chat commentary where we chat about everything. Uh, It's one of the things about uh, uh, comparing... Uh, uh, graphics cards or consoles to PCs. And that's one thing I'm not understanding. I mean, it's okay for the Xbox fanboys to compare everything. Everything. Y'all can compare everything. As long as... Oh, th- I, I gotta get to this part. But let me say what I gotta say before I should jump to this part right here. Y'all can compare everything to your consoles as long... Keyword, as long. As your console is winning. But as soon as your console is getting its ass kicked. Y'all sit up there and say. Oh you can't compare that. You can't compare Xbox. Oh uh, Xbox One S to a PS4 Neo. Oh you can't compare a, a PC to the PS. Uh, to the Xbox One S. But um. If I'm not mistake, mistaken. Wasn't y'all comparing shit. A few. You know, a, a few months ago, all I shared talking about uh, 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 the power of the cloud is more powerful than three titans. Wasn't that not said? Because I, I remember something like that was saying that the Xbox uh, Scorpio, and that's another. Oh, help me. Oh, my God. You know what? I got to talk about this, too. You know what? I'm just bringing up so much things, and I don't even think I got enough time to even talk about all this shit on this Sunday chat commentary. But <laughs> yeah, I also talked about the fact that that you know I might I might have to save this for another commentary because I might go real too deep inside that shit, and uh, that's what she said <laughs> that I might not be able to finish off this. I might not have that time to finish off that, but um. Yeah, um, y'all compared the PS4 Neo and the Xbox One S and the Xbox Three, um, Xbox One and the Scorpio, and the shit being said that the Scorpio is gonna be more powerful than PCs, and that you know, fuck it, I'm just gonna talk about it. It was said from an X fact that the Xbox Scorpio. Is going to be able to do 4K better than the PC. Oh, my God. Did y'all just hear that shit, guys? An Xbox Scorpio is going to be able to do 4K better than the PC. Wow. Now, let me see. Oh, let me see. I can play... Every game that came out already, plus new games that just came out right now, in 4K, 60. Right now. I've proved it. If y'all watched my latest videos, y'all see me been playing a lot of my games in 4K, 60 frames per second. With no frame rate drops on certain games. I was even able to play Grand Theft Auto V. And 4K at 60 frames per second. That's right. 4K. 60 frames per second. Not 1440p. I was actually playing when 2160. Was it 2160p? I was actually playing that resolution at 60 frames per second. And if the frames did drop, guess what? It dropped two frames. Now, y'all getting happy because... 
It's being said that y'all can play NBA 2K and 4K. I'm believing it's 4K. But in 4K at 60 frames per second. Okay. Hmm. NBA 2K, 60 frames per second on the Xbox One S. Um, can I answer, can I, can I answer that question for you guys really, really quick? Can I, can I? NBA 2K does not have any graphical fidelity or anything towards it that's going to make frame rates dip towards it. There's nothing on NBA 2K that's going to put some pressure on the GPU or put pressure on the CPU. Okay? There's no texture stuff on it that's going to make this game unable to play. I don't... <laughs> you hear how I sound right now? It's like... Y'all getting excited for the shit. Right? Y'all so excited that you maybe play NBA 2K and 4K at 60. I can do that right now without my GPU getting a sweat. But... <laughs> You know what? I'm not going to even go into this. I'm, I'm just going to stop that right now because I just got to sit up there and laugh about the situation. Because if you know shit about a PC and you know shit about graphic cards and shit like that, you can't compare NBA 2K to a game like Grand Theft Auto. Why? Because there's multiple things happening. NBA 2K, there's nothing really happening. Besides the character, the ball, and some of some of the you know gameplay, not the crowd, cause the crowd ain't gonna do shit. The crowd ain't really nothing, but a fake little. <laughs> you know, I'm not gonna go into that. You know, I'm just gonna stay. Like, I'm not gonna touch that with a ten foot pole. I'm just gonna just drop that conversation because, you know, it's very very stupid. I'm not gonna go into that. But what I am gonna talk about. Is this? It was also said. Also said. You know, I. It's like I want to talk about a lot of these things, but it's like I don't want to go into it. But we're going to talk about this. We're going to talk about it. Xbox One S, right? Versus PS4 Neo. Right? Y'all talking about. I had to pause for a second there, guys. I had to pause. Let's let's just flip this around. And then I'll come out a little bit better the way how I want to say it, the way how I want to say this. We won an NPD. <laughs> we won two months of NPDs. But wasn't it you guys that said, uh, it don't matter, resolution don't matter, uh, sales don't matter, uh, graphics don't matter, uh, none of this shit matter, but as long as you win an NPD, right, as long as Xbox win an NPD, it's relevant, right, it's relevant, X, Sony is never gonna catch back up, my bad guys, I hit my mic, Sony is never going to catch back up, right? So, uh, 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 the Xbox, we're dominating. Um, is it all right for me to talk now? Can I talk? Can, can, can I, can I talk? Can I talk? Okay, I can? Okay, okay, good. You want to know why Xbox is winning right now? <laughs> Y'all really want to know why Xbox is winning right now? Okay, I'm going to tell you the reason why Xbox is winning right now. We're going to tell you why the Xbox is winning right now. PlayStation Neo, or let's change the name, PlayStation Pro will be out in exactly two to three weeks. 
So, why will anybody go out and buy a PlayStation 4, PlayStation 4 Slim, when there is new hardware that is powerful? Watch this. Pop. <laughs> when is there a new console that's going to be able to play your games and 4K native? 4K native. That's the reason why I, that's the reason why I'm buying the play. Actually, I pre-ordered mines and I can't wait. And you know what my my uh, my PlayStation is going to is going to go to my 4K monitor or my 4K TVs. Well, my 4K monitors or my 4K TV. That's right. My PlayStation Pro is going to go there. I don't have to worry about upscaling because guess what's what's going to happen? All my games that's already been out is going to get a pro update. Meaning, I will be able to do the exact thing. The exact thing that the fucking Xbox One has do, but better. And it's already been proven. So, that's the whole reason why I don't want to go out and really get an Xbox One S. Because, one, I don't watch movies in um, 4K or a Blu-ray player. I, I don't watch TV really like that. So that doesn't matter to me. When I do watch TV or when I do want to do things in 4K, I'll stream it. That's why I got a 4K TV and I have a 4K monitor. I don't really watch TV. And when I watch TV... It's very, very minimal. I don't watch it. So I don't really care about it. I want a game in 4K. I want to be able to sit back and relax and play these games in 4K and enjoy myself and be able to play PC type graphics. That's the reason why I brought a PC. That's the reason why everything that I play right now is PC wise. Every game that I've purchased so far lately has been on PC. Y'all notice y'all have not been seeing me do any unboxings really for any PS4 games or Xbox One games. You wanna know why? Because PC is the best B to play your games at. I'm I'm straight PC gaming now. And I've been loving PC gaming. I was gonna buy um Mafia 3 on the PS4. But I'd rather it on a freaking uh, 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 PC because it's better. I'm getting the more bang for my buck. Even though it has some bugs and shit like that, I'm happy. I'm playing my games. Now, here's the, here's the good thing about PC gaming, what a lot of you guys don't think about. And, yeah, that's another topic, but I just want to tell you something. Games like Mafia, games like Grand Theft, I mean Grand Theft Auto, games like Mafia, games like Grand, uh, Gears of War, I can use my controller and play the game and go to my big screen 3D TV or my 4K TV and game like that without a problem in 4K. So that was the Sunny Chat commentary, guys. And remember, it's your boy Daddy Easy here. Remember, live it, love it, game it. Peace and deuces, and I'll catch you guys later. Holla.